Hi, and thank you for watching. On today's show, we're going to talk about screen sharing. Yeah. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, so from the tons of questions we get about this, apparently you guys want to screen share your phones or smart devices to the face of your radio. For whatever reason. I don't know. Yeah. But you want to do it. So we thought we'd explain to you some of the ways you can do that. To get right out of the gate, there is no more mirror link. Mirror link doesn't exist. These radios don't support it, and the phones that have it are going away. Android is going to switch to a new thing called Mirrorcast. Now, that's a benefit, because Mirrorcast can be done over the air. Now, for all you guys out there that have Android phones that are Mirrorcast compatible, go on to Amazon, type in Belkin, and Mirrorcast. Boom! There's a dongle that comes up for like 50 bucks. Buy it, plug it into the HDMI in the back of the radio, and as long as your phone is Mirrorcast compatible, your phone will appear on the face of your radio. It's just like that. Boom! Now, for you iPhone guys, yeah, it's a little bit harder. <laughs> you have to have an HDMI cable, because this radio has an HDMI input. That is the key, NEX, with the exception of the 5100. For you guys that have a 5100 and are watching this video thinking, oh, cool, guess what, no. Go back and watch the regular AVH radios and find out about an iSimple Media Links. That's how you're going to do it on that one. That's not this video, though. Now, for you Apple guys, you need a lightning to HDMI adapter, okay? Now, it has a lightning adapter input on it as well, and that is for charge. That's all it's for. You can charge it via the USB 2. You can charge it via a cigarette lighter adapter. Any way you want, doesn't matter to us. All it's there for is charge. You don't even have to use it if you don't want to. I don't want I to. I know, right? So, plug into HDMI. Now, the HDMI cable. Good thing we're mentioning that. It's very important you get a high quality heat resistant cable. Okay. Okay, because this is going in your car and your car is going to get hot. For our vehicles, believe it or not, we buy the Kenwood HDMI cable. It's got a nice small head on it, makes it easy to plug into the back of the yeah. radios. It's not too deep and it doesn't melt. There you go. Some of the cheaper cables, you're on your own. Now, quick troubleshooting tip. If for some reason you can't get this to work in your car, that's cool. Get out of your car, walk into your house with your cables, okay, or your dongle if you're doing the mirror casting. Plug it into the HDMI input on your TV set. Try to get it to work there first. Okay, that way you're not scratching up the interior of your car or accidentally scratch your radio or bang your head against the wall because you just can't get it to work. If you can't get it to work on the TV in your living room, it's not the car's fault. It's you got a bad cable or you haven't paired it properly. Yeah. Okay, so troubleshooting tip 101. Okay, right. we do it, you do it, it's all good. Now, we got our HDMI, we got our lightning adapter. Plug the two together, boom. Now, we take our phone, we've got a charger, plug that in. And we got these. This is our Apple cord. We're going to plug this in here. We got our big old thing. Unlock the phone. Let's go to the face of the radio. Now, regardless of whatever adapter you're using, whether it be an HDMI dongle or the lightning adapter, or if you still have an MHL compatible phone, um, this has to be highlighted. So you have to be able to touch it. If you can't touch it, that means it's not reading the HTML information. So boom, now we're screen sharing. Screen sharing basically means I can't touch any of my icons and have it work. All I can do is have it display it on the phone, or display the phone on the screen. And we got cool stuff happening here, and... Ooh, we can do some Bates Motel. Uh, we can scroll up here. It's crazy. What do we got? We got anything good? Hey, let's watch Dolphin Tales. Yay! So you get the idea. So we'll go ahead and start a movie. Um, just so you can see it. Just gonna press play. And there you go. Playing it. Alright, 
so now you can pretty much display anything you want as you can see though I'm not not touching here um, you have you know any, anything that will display on the face of your radio will display on here okay so it can be YouTube Hulu doesn't matter you can also if you have a favorite navigation app you have one of those display on the radio you get the idea it's screen sharing anything that's on the phone is going to be on the radio now there is a quality difference now I got it's there's a quality difference this is not 1080 by any stretch of the imagination okay this is an 800 by 480 screen and to reference that to something you might know VHS tapes okay VHS tapes yep. that's, that's what we're looking at here okay so it's not real clear it's not the crispest thing in the world crispest Crispus. Crispus. All right, but if it's what you want to do, this is how you do it. So, all right, so thank you for watching. You guys can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. And we'll have links to that uh, dongle Belkin piece in the comments. So if you guys want to purchase one of those, you're more than welcome to do it. They work really good. Sorry we don't have a video on that yet. We're working on it. That's all I got to say about that. Uh, if you like the video, please subscribe. Otherwise, if you have a question, leave it down below and I will get back to you. You guys have a good night and we will see you next time. Bye.